best game on the schedule today in college basketball. Miami does him scoring mark, which is 36. Didn't quite get there, but the Aztecs will control off the jump. San Diego State, 10 and 1 on the year, lost their opener on an aircraft carry on a windy evening against Syracuse. They've won 10 straight since. Down low, this is Franklin going right to work. Well, they, that's exactly how they started yesterday's game as well, if you remember, partner. Back-to-back -back possessions, executing, getting Franklin involved early. The Wooden Award candidate, one of the more dynamic players in all of college basketball. Try to get him off early. Stevens collapsed immediately on him. If you're Gant, you've got to read that and understand where the open spot is and make yourself available. Odom goes cross court of the game. The Sycamores want to keep the A-Rob. The backdoor cut fell short on the shot. The follow-up, though, by R.J. Mahirin. This is Justin Gant getting loose, and he is able to make the San Diego State defense pay. Gant had a double-double against Old Miss, 12 points, 11 rebounds. Well, the versatility of Indiana State. Their bigs can step out and they can shoot. Well, it's happily. Misses everything on that one. O'Brien, J.J. O'Brien with the follow, and he can't convert. He'll go low to Mahirin, jump hook, yes. See, gets it up top. And there on the catch with Tapa, no question about it. Here's Thames. Hesitation move, and he's able to finish. And see, that's, that's a Tapley effect. Odom unable to help off and pinch on the strong side wing, and that's what allowed Thames to get to the rim. And a he came earlier this season. And Thames able to hit the mid-ranger right there. Thank Franklin with the pump and the kiss. Tapley sets up and hits. Here we go again, perhaps. Well, some statistical benefit in the inside. Described as a workout freak. Said to lift weights six or seven times a week. As Thames is able to knock it down from straight away. He's three or four from the field. This is Mahirin, yes. Yeah, we saw him do that a couple of times yesterday. As expected, Thames picks up the dribble. Down low, this is Johnson. Anticipated a make. It wouldn't have been a basket, and Steve Fisher still applauded him. Here's the alley-oop attempt. Johnson misses it. But look at O'Brien at the right spot, at the right time, and that only comes from effort. That is a two-point effort play for the San Diego State Aztecs. Coming off of that career-high 27-point effort of his program and, and how others view his program. Of course, Arizona playing in the other semifinal tonight against Arizona. Here's what Sean Miller, of the head coach of the Wildcats, had to say. They have been the best program in the West for the last seven years, and Gonzaga too. Uh, so San Diego State has a great team, and that's a lot of respect from Sean Miller, who has coached a lot of great teams in his tenure, and it's a testament to that man right there. And Coach Fisher, you look at the active streets that they have. Stevens, power dribble, not there for him. Cummings finishes a dynamic end-to-end -end run there by Dewan Cummings. Waves it off. Going one-on-one -on -one against Gant, pulls up for three, off the mark. Odom. Not a bad effort, but it came after the horn, so that's a 63 for San Diego State. How about the defensive rotation of the Sycamores on this possession? Rahan leaves it down low for Spencer, and he's found in that offensive look. That was flow, that was rhythm. Courtesy Rahan for three. That's a step in three in the open floor transition. Franklin falls to the floor, Mahir of this second half. Tapley. Bounce pass to Shepard. Floater doesn't go. Loose ball, Spencer winds up with it. That ball literally went through the legs of Chase Tapley. They're making the Aztecs work at the offensive end of the floor. Fantastic job of getting back defensively that time by the Sycamores. They got stuck on 13 for a while in the first half. They've got to avoid getting stuck on 38. Franklin to Gant. Great feed, great finish. And that's where Odom is dangerous. When he gets in the middle, breaks down your defense completely. You have to... Eight points, four assists now for Jake Odom. Tapley with the left hand. The 
Bruins on the bucket. Slicing down the lane, tried to shovel it to Gantt, but it got deflected out of bounds. And Thames loses it out. Mahirin leading the scoring for Indiana State at 12. Here's Franklin. He's got nine points and 11 rebounds draw. Here's a rob Nice drop off and the cram by Justin Gantt. Well, notice they took Franklin off a rob on that possession and drawing 2-2, able to kick. Really competitive games here at the Diamond. The only thing that possession accomplished was taking time off the clock. Franklin, he pulls up for three and missed. And Odom takes him out, and the initial signal is an intentional foul. And then you you bring it back up. Franklin and Odom and wins. Here's Tapley for three. Yeah. Five point for possession for Chase Tapley. And the back looked like he may have strained it in the defensive stance against a rob while Odom made a five point Chase Tapley play. Now that has factored in here. Thames blocked from behind. The bounce pass ahead, though, broken up by a rob The shot from the baseline is good. Sports Center the other night. He saw Tyson Chandler do it in the Knicks game. Saw the Nick Johnson 360 in the Arizona game yesterday, too, and probably thinking uh, maybe I can get a nod for top plays. Thames, the hesitation move. Goes high off the glass with the left hand. No Spencer, the rebound. Put back too strong. Thames, the pull up jumper. Yes, that's huge. Uh, I think Thames. His 10 points and the way he's gotten his 10 points and some of the defense in which he's played, he has been every bit. Mahirin. And Tapley brings it down. And leaving it up and Franklin finishing reverse style. And just the elevation, the adjustment in the air by Franklin. Versatile. One word you can use to describe Jamal Franklin. 15 points, 13 rebounds. He's got 15 points on only nine field goal attempts to go. He's good on the first try. A 10-game win streak on the line. And a trip to the final of the Hawaiian Airlines Diamond Head Classic. Two big free throws back to back. And now the Sycamore's got to hurry up. A rub. Nice pump fake. Cleared two Aztec defenders out of the way. Mahirin cleans it up and one. Second one is good. Six point advantage for the Aztecs. You knock him down. He's eight of ten. Make it nine for 11. So nine of his 19 have come at the free throw line. Odom letting it roll up the floor. It's desperation time now for Indiana State. A rub. The riser from three, off the mark, pulled down fittingly by Franklin. Tapley has it, and he'll be fouled. This could get them to 63 points, which is that number for Indiana State, but for their attention to detail. Streak will extend to 11 for San Diego State. All the other streaks we talked about, they will punch a ticket to the championship of the Hawaiian Airlines Diamond Head Classic. What do you think about their chances against either Arizona or Miami, which will play out in the late semifinal tonight? Yeah, as Franklin grabs another rebound, I'd say they're pretty good. They win. They prove that they could win today at a tempo that is not at their ideal liking. And yet they survive and they advance. And all that's moving on to the championship game.